Hey guys, it's me Dolly. Welcome to another mukbang. Today is a vegan vegetarian mukbang by Subway. I got my Diet Pepsi because I gotta have my diet. I've actually cut back a lot on pop and diet drinks. I've been mainly only drinking water, which I'm very proud of. Um, so once in a blue moon I'll have a pop. And I have my Veggie Delight sub, no cheese, it's supposed to be toasted, I can't tell. And then the sweet onion sauce, and then I have my Miss Vicky's sea salt and vinegar chips. So these are vegetarian, they are not vegan, because it says it contains milk, wheat, and barley ingredients, so the milk makes it vegetarian. I was craving salt and vinegar. This is like my favorite sub now. It has like almost all the veggies except for tomatoes, olives, but it pretty much has every other one. And if you've noticed, I cut my hair. I need to wash it. It's third day hair, so all the curl is gone. There's some waves in it now. But I it used to be down here, so I cut off a good cup, good couple inches. <clears throat> but I'm gonna put it up because I still can which I love and I'm gonna open my drink I love that sound <clears throat> I should make like this bunny hug or like the blue one too my trademark or my brand because I feel like I wear it a lot <clears throat> but this sub is so tasty. And there's not much veggies on here, but oh well. They packed it full at the location near my house, but this is a different location. I had it delivered while I was at um, taking the kids to school, so. Well, I know I sound sick. I'm all congested, and I'm going to be sniffing through the video. But, mm. So let's talk about why I went vegetarian. <clears throat> so after <clears throat> After I've, after I had my taco time mukbang where I had the vegetarian taco salad, I started thinking maybe I should just keep going eating like this. And then like, sh like shortly thereafter, the thought of meat like made me gag. And I, I thought about all the gristle and all the fat and all that kind of stuff and I'm like, do I actually really like meat? Not really. I'm very picky.
I only liked white meat <clears throat> without like any tendons or gristle or anything. And if I felt anything on there of that sort, or even like fat on the breast meat, I would gag and I would spit it out. Um, and that was the same for turkey. Um, pork, I didn't really eat much. If I did, it was and sausage gravy which mainly I had the pork there for the flavor not really because of the meat because like the texture actually kind of and uh, steak I don't like steak unless it's round steak with no fat or gristle anything on it cut off has to be cooked well done and that was like when I ate meat so <sighs> I figured since I don't really eat meat anyway, I would just find, eat meat alternatives. And I find they taste much better, even tofu marinated and stuff and cooked up. Tastes way better than chicken or meat itself. But I guess I'm weird like that. I started watching vegan YouTubers that did mukbangs or just vegan YouTubers in general. Just cause. I don't know. Before. <clears throat> for a very long time. I would go watch them sometimes. And then I start. That's why I wanted to include a vegetarian option for my mukbang. And then. I just started craving veggies and beans and lentils and legumes and potatoes and rice and all that kind of stuff. I just craved it. And I didn't crave like meat or bacon or anything like that anymore. And now it's just kind of come habit and routine and I just crave like the meat replacement and veggies and like spinach and smoothies and all that kind of stuff. I do still have baked goods or like breads and stuff or like this um, if it has like milk or eggs in it but I don't actually eat eggs themselves and for milk I try not drinking actual milk if I can get away with um, just having coconut milk or like cashew milk or something or not milk in, at all um, I would rather just drink cashew or um, coconut milk as opposed to cow milk or dairy milk now but like I said if it's a baked good or we're having macaroni and cheese or that kind of thing I will have that so that's why I call myself vegetarian. But I've replaced my honey, which is crazy for me to think. I used to say, no, I can't give up my honey, but I replaced it with agave. And um, I don't eat fish. Actually, when I had sushi that last time, I got really sick. Um, so hopefully this sticks. I'm finding I don't want to eat meat like I went to McDonald's and I was gonna get the veggie wrap but they didn't have it so I just had french fries and ate at home later but yeah I don't miss it which is weird you, I wouldn't think me saying that now would have happened actually oh, okay uh, if you ask me if I would ever be vegetarian or vegan about like maybe six months ago I'd be like no I can't give up my milk I can't give up my um, meat I can't give up like that my honey but small little changes kind of help me um, and then the main contributor to me wanting to try this vegetarian diet is to lower my cholesterol because I got told my high cholesterol 
like the bad stuff was a little bit high and so that's why I'm trying this I'm on a limited time frame. So let's try some of my chips. I haven't tried this brand of chips before, I don't think. Maybe I have, I just don't remember. They're a lot thicker cut. I don't know if you can even see that. Stupid white balance. Okay. See that? It says crafted with care and then because it's a Canadian company and it has to say it in French no trans fat low and saturated fat no artificial flavors or colors and colors is spelled with a U no preserv preservatives no MSG and cholesterol free and proudly kettled cooked in Can Canada with farm grown potatoes and then of course it has to say all that in French because it's a Canadian company. If you're vegan or vegetarian, how did you start out? Let me know down below. That would be interesting. We can talk about it. Ooh, I love this bread. <laughs> That's the Italian bread, which is one of the ones that is vegan. A bunch of plans for new videos. I will share some ideas with you. Okay, so one of my ideas with it was this mukbang. I made dormy review, which is the bra panties and um, lingerie subscription thing. Um, pre-kindergarten er interview so an interview with Amy like I did with Noah but hers is going to be now because she just started in January and then we'll do another one at the end of the year with both kids separate videos I will do a what products I use in Amy's hair because she has curly hair even though her hair is a hot mess most of the time, I will still do that video just to show you what we use when it does look nice and, and presentable. Oh. How we potty train Noah. I know I said I would do that video like a year ago. I'm still working on it. Um, maybe a day in the life video, um, a vegetarian cooking video, like a vegetarian recipe video haven't figured out what to do with that one and then hopefully I'm trying to convince Carl to do an update on Carl's health etc or his view on the whole past year and a half and I'm hoping to get him to film his story um, on video for you guys
If you notice my little friend back there, that is my grandmother's doll I talked about in my um, ghost experiences video, which I'll put in the iCard, which is... Boop. Okay. What is your favorite sub from Subway? Vegan or not, or vegetarian or not? What's your favorite sub? I haven't eaten very much today, so this is the only thing I've eaten so far. So don't judge me for eating a foot long sub. Huh? I realize this is a very mellow video. I'm not all like woohoo kind of because I am sick. But I'm getting better. It's just because it's almost spring. Allergies, they kick my butt. <laughs> So that foot long is done. And I am stuffed. I will probably have one more of the chips and leave the rest for the kids for a snack. But anyway. So that is the mukbang for this week. If you like this vlog, hit the thumbs up button, leave a friendly comment down below, and check out the description box where I will leave playlists for other videos like this. Make sure to subscribe, make sure to hit the bell icon button to be notified when I make new videos Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye!